Welcome back to Splode Plays. Oh, I guess I should show you what's up here. The uh, score count right now for those keeping track is two deaths for me, one for you. Yeah. There's uh, do, this up here. Oh, uh, Vanilla secret. Okay. I don't know. I won't do the secrets yet. I'll do the castle okay. first and then I'll do the secrets. Okay, good plan. Because that can be considered like the fourth world. Because the fourth world, you really only have the two levels, right? Yes. Good point. We'll save that for later. Yeah. Save you later. And then you get to meet Reznor. Excellent. So he's the uh, the mid, kind of the mini castle boss. Yeah. Or what do you want to call them? They have real castles for the Koopa Kids, and then they have like midway castles. Yeah. Where it's kind of like a Mario three. Where Trent Reznor, uh, the is Triceratops. It... Is that why they called it Reznor? Is because Trent Reznor wanted it to be named Reznor? <laughs> Well, listen, all the all the Koopa kids are musicians, right? Yeah, oh, I guess, hey. I, I think we're reaching. I Was he even famous when this game came out? Maybe. When, was he, when wasn't he famous, noobs? I don't know. <laughs> <We're>, <laughs> uh, fun fact for, <laughs> for those keeping track at home, again, uh, we're nerds, and we don't really know about things like music, so... Ah, <laughs> uh, I love Trent Reznor. I love my channel. What are you talking about? <laughs> Another fun fact... I'm a huge nerd and don't know anything about music. Candy Gamera is a much more well-rounded human being. <laughs> and a better person all around. <laughs> me, 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 me. Wait, wait, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow, some crazy swimming there. Yeah, Mario, he's quite precise in his uh, swimming. Why is it that... Uh, Mario and Luigi, they're so damn fat, but they uh, run they, fast and They stuff? get so much exercise, and they jump higher than any human being. And all they eat is mushrooms and feathers and flowers. Yeah, why are they so fat when they live on a diet, diet solely comprised of mushrooms? That's a good... I don't know, maybe it's like... What are those big mushrooms called that they put on burgers sometimes? Like shiitake, or... I don't know, there are a lot of different kinds of mushrooms. Maybe it's just like a big fatty mushroom they eat. Are, are there fatty mushrooms? I don't think so. Am I boned here? No, you're not. There was two big boos? Oh yeah, because you sk skipped that level. Yeah. Or you went up a level, you didn't skip up a level. I'm playing the sucker route. Yeah. Whereas you're too good to ever play the sucker route. I know. I'm too good for this game. Oh my god. I quit that this was, LP. That was the lamest hit. I know, I was like... Oh, a little closer, a little closer. Too close! Oh. And now I'm at the place where I always die uh, without uh, without being Big Mario. You know, for all the, the time the internet spends making jokes about the lack of logic in Mario, I feel like not enough time has been devoted to the, the strange idea that there is a big and a little Mario. Like, uh, what's, what's up with that? There. That's how we do it, kids. You did it! And he did it as Tiny Mario! <laughs> I I don't get Tiny Mario. Like, I think... at the end of the game, like, if you beat Bowser with Tiny yeah. Mario, Peach is so much taller than you. Yeah, it's a little bit weird. But I thought Small Mario was, in fact, just called Mario. And Big Mario was Super Mario. Oh. Isn't that the story? Probably. I think that's how it goes in the original game. I don't game. know how the legends go. But in this, kind of your standard Mario is Big Mario. Because there's no way Peach would be hooking up with a two foot tall man. Oh, you're, wow, you're playing some good tricks here. I, why am I talking? Now, oh. could you just jump infinitely on that shell and get a ton of lives? Probably. No, I don't think you can actually. Not like that. Okay. Do -do -do -do. I don't know. How do I shot fire? Here's a, here's a question for the viewers. Do you find it annoying when we make sound effects? <laughs> I don't. I think I love it. Okay. Uh, red. Wow. Another Switch Palace for us. Go team. And then they just fly out and disperse across the world. How do they know where they're going? I, yeah, good point. It's not, When you think of a Switch, you think it'd be activating something somewhere. But in fact, it's just spraying blocks yep. across the world. Oh, it's Blarg. I love Blarg. <laughs> he looks like he's got a mental problem. He does. All of the downs. Once again, no offense to the kids at home. <laughs> or all offense. 
fence. Whoa. That's a steep little uh, fall there. Mario. I like how that one skull just quivers. You and I, I was playing some Mario 64 for the first time in a long time. Uh-huh. The other night. And uh, I, I never realized before how much just like quivering and just basically, uh, what, what would be the word? Jittery? Jittering out that game does. Just all the, like, the camera is just in a constant state of being destroyed by what's going on in the screen. Yeah. Like, every time you're on the brink of falling off a ledge, it just shakes like I know, a... and you're like, well, okay, what's happening here? I, I was trying to make a Parkinson's joke. That's what I was trying to do. One time, I made a Parkinson's joke, and then the next day, the Pope died. Is that a coincidence? <laughs> uh, you killed the Pope. That's unacceptable. Don't tell anybody I killed the Pope. You know, the funny thing about the Pope is there's always a new the Pope. <laughs> I know. Did you Speaking of the Pope... And if we mentioned Nicki Minaj earlier. Yeah. She dressed up as the Pope at the Grammys. That oh. Was offended many viewers, apparently. Well, I don't really uh, care about those viewers. Yeah, no, I think it's hilarious. If I could dress like the Pope and be a fancy star, I'd be like, bitch, I'm the Pope. Well, why didn't you dress like the Pope at your wedding? Or would that be especially inappropriate? <laughs> hey, everybody, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> what do you get out of these red blocks? Can Nothing. you not break them? No, you don't get anything from the red or the blue blocks. Oh, this is an outrage. See, that's a sign that this game doesn't have enough power-ups. I know. You should... Because yellow gives you, a, what, a mushroom, right? And the green gives you the feather. So... The red should give you the fire flower, and the blue... I don't know. Wait, wait, wait. The blue should give you a blue Yoshi. I don't know. Yeah. Or just a new thing. Yeah. Like, there's... I mean, there's no Kurobo shoe. There's no Tanuki suit. That's one thing that needs to come back in the new Mario games, is the shoe. Uh, yeah. You know what it bothers me? And I think, I mean, tell me if I'm wrong here, but... It's not a power-up? In Mario 3, the Tanuki suit was quite rare. Mm -hmm. And it, it just turned you into a statue. Yeah. And the main flying item oh, oh. was the, the, what, the tail, the raccoon tail. Yeah. They were two separate items. But Nintendo conveniently forgot that for Mario 3D Land, and they they amalgamated the two items into one, the much more obscure Tanuki suit. Like, am I right here? Yeah, you're right. Like, uh, what's going on with that? Oh. Miyamoto's old. Maybe it's just forgot. It's just, <laughs> can't be bothered to check. Yeah. I'm not a fan of this next level. Uh, I'm just gonna put that out there. Vanilla Dome 4. Yeah. Would you uh, mind explaining why that might be? I don't know, I just don't really like it. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is a fun level. I like this level. I'm just not a fan of it. I like that it's easy if you jump on the inside. But then if you want to be crazy, you can jump on the outside of the uh, the little planks there. Outside of the planks? Like on the outer edge of the plank. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. You can play a much more... Oh, hazardous? Hazardous, uh, thrilling sort of game. Whoa! Oh, Jesus. Also, it took me so long to realize those were arms. <laughs> Yeah, that's a good point. I don't think I ever really realized that until I just saw them, like, animated on the internet. Yeah. Wow. Whoa. Uh oh Whoa. Shit, shit. What are you doing? What are you doing? Whoa. Whoa. That was thrilling. <laughs> it was pretty exciting. I'm glad I could bring excitement to And, you. I mean, you had the audacity to insult this level, but... That was actually pretty cool. I won't lie. I might have to take back what I said about this level. Whoa, shit. Whoa. Oh, uh, no, I take it. If you're really good, I think you can, like, jump on all those bullets and get a ton of lives. If you're really good, you don't do that. Yeah. I think that's why I don't like this level, is because I'm not very good at it. I didn't even get the halfway point, did I? No, you didn't. I'm sorry. So that's, like, double bone. Where did I go? There I am. Kamikaze! Look at that. I did it. Well, congr congratulations. I didn't, I didn't get all the Yoshi coins, though. Nah, it's okay. 
It doesn't it doesn't record it anyways. That's true. Now is this is this castle right here, is this it for this level? Yep. Lem Lemmy. Who is Lemmy based on? Um I don't know. We should like start looking that up or something. I feel like that's an important part of this game. Wow. Well, oh, I think he isn't he like a dude for ACDC? Really? Oh. Or something? Uh, I don't know. You know which one I I actually get the joke of? <laughs> well, I'm a joke. <laughs> Lud Ludwig von Koopa. Yeah. Ludwig von Beethoven. Yeah. And, uh, you know, Clockwork Orange, uh, kids. If you don't know your Beethoven, go watch Clockwork oh! Orange. We are pathetic human beings. I thought I could, like, run all the way to the edge. Uh, once again, that's three for me and two for you. Oh. oh. Well, yeah. Fuck you. Oh dear. Oh. What, what the hell was that? We used to be cool. Oh. He's gonna walk towards you. I'm just doing this. Okay. Stay there, wizard. Stay there, wizard. Yeah, that's right. You stay there. Obey me. Okay, fire thing, wizard. Fire thing, wizard. Run! Go! This is really... Let's it's okay. This. It'll be okay. Deep breaths. Can I cry tears of joy if I beat him? You are entirely welcome to do that. I'll be like, thank you, God. Oh my God. Oh, 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 good play. She's doing well. This is so intense. You're, you're being very thorough with your kills. I think that's smart. Well, because if they come back, they'll get me. That sounded really paranoid. Yeah, no, I mean, it's, it's true, though. Kids, deal with your enemies. Before uh, they come get you in your sleep. Um, efficiently. <laughs> Okay. Death to dry bones. Pretty confident you can do it. I believe in you. I know you got the power. Deep breath. Okay. <sighs> Here we go. Go away, fireball. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, Take good play. That. Good play. Oh. <laughs> so, <laughs> My heavy panting. It's okay. Oh, you got two. You got two. We're good. We're good. Come oh. on, get over there. Drive to the goal. Yeah! Yes! Half an hour. Congratulations. You owe me a Coke. A ice cold Coca Cola <laughs> is coming your way. Whew, we did it. We are now formally, officially blowing up the castle. Oh, no, oh, we're yeah, hammering. Oh, yeah, hammer time. Wow. <laughs> that looks like a ton of work. Wow. There's Lemmy. And uh, Luigi has triumphed over Lemmy Koopa. Oh, it asks us, have you found the red and green switches yet? Which indeed we have. Yeah, we have. Why are you even asking? Pay attention. So, uh, next episode we'll be hitting up, uh, secret world, secret levels over there, and then we're hitting up the bridge. I'm saving that shit so we don't ever have to do it again. So, uh, let's, let's take a break. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs>